Hey guys, welcome back to Come Again, where all geek culture collides. I'm Shannon, and this week on your pop review, we're going to be taking a look at the pop movie Star Trek Beyond number 356, Jayla Vinyl Figures, so stay tuned. Alright guys, as I said, welcome back to Come Again, where all geek culture collides. This week on another pop review, we have the pop movies, Star Trek Beyond, number 356, Jayla, a vinyl figure. As you can see here, my box is a little crushed a little bit. I got this on sale at, uh, at GameStop, um, so it was just kind of in, in a bin, crushed, smashed in there. I wanted a Star Wars pop. Excuse the interruption, folks. My geek card has been suspended until I can learn the difference between Star Wars and Star Trek. I do apologize for this mistake. I assure you it will never happen again. We now return you to your regularly scheduled pop review. It was either this or Scotty, and I didn't really care for Scotty. Uh, they also had a Jim Kirk. Um, I'm not really a fan of the... I'm not a super fan of the original series or the new movies. Uh, I'm more of a TNG era fan, um, but I did like Jayla in this movie. So as we got here, we got Jayla standing, uh, showing up here. Got her peeking out there. Display side. Number 347 was Captain Kirk. 348 is Spock. 349 is Bones. 350 is Sulu. 351 is Chekhov, 352 Scotty, 353 Uhura, 354 Captain Kirk in survival suit, 355 is Chekhov in survival suit, 356 is Jayla, 357 is Crawl. All right, so as you can see here, she has a little bit of smudge or something here on her forehead. I'm not really sure what that's about. Um, I don't know if this was a pre-owned figure. Maybe that's why it was for sale. I don't know. But I'm not really caring for that smudge. Um, the detail is really nice. Nice paint job on the face, eyes, the white hair. Really nice detail on the suit. Um, this is what I was talking about last time uh, with my Green Ranger review. You know, you've got... He had very little detail for them to paint on. Uh... All right, guys. Sorry about that. I got a notification saying that my battery was getting low. Didn't realize it because I can't really see the battery meter on my phone uh, while I'm filming. Uh, so I, I had to plug this in real quick. Uh, so as I was saying, you have all this area that's very nicely detailed. Um, hardly any paint blemishes. Let's zoom in. There we go. Here's a little bit right along there, but not bad. It's such a small area. It's not even noticeable. They really took their time painting this figure. A little bit of paint bleeding there. But as I said, not a big deal. It's not a very big area. Unless you're looking super closely, you're not even really going to tell. And she does come with a stand. And there actually is a place on this one for a stand in the uh, clamshell right at the bottom there. And this clamshell, it does not have the uh, 
little clamps on it. So it's just going to stay there and flop around. But there you have it, guys. On this week's pop review, we just took a look at the Funko Pop movies, Star Trek Beyond, 356, Jayla Vinyl figure. Tune in next Tuesday for another pop review right here on Comagen TV, where all geek culture collides. Hey guys, if you like this video, make sure you smash that subscribe button and click on the little bell to receive notifications on all our upcoming videos. Hit the like button, make sure and leave us a comment so we know how you felt about this video. And don't forget to share with your family and friends. Until next time, I'm Shannon from Come Again, where all geek culture collides.